Hey everyone, Pupsker here, and today in Warframe, we're gonna go over how you can farm Citrine in Warframe. She is the gem Warframe, good support, damage, status damage, really all around, and has damage reduction, so good Warframe. In order to farm Citrine, you need to have completed the Heart of Deimos quest. This is step one, essentially, Heart of Deimos. Because you need to get access to Deimos, as well as in order to build one of the parts, you need to have at least rank two in the Entrati standing in order to buy, I think, Stellated Necrothene. It's one of the build materials for Citrine. Once you're actually done completing Heart of Deimos and you have some access there, you are ready to farm up Citrine. Overall, she is actually a pretty simple Warframe. She is farmed on one map node that is on Mars, Tyana's Pass or Tyana Pass right here. This again requires Heart of Deimos to complete and it's just a mirror defense. If you want to get all of the parts for Citrine, you need to farm it up to C drop rotation. That means I think each mirror defense rotation is two and a half minutes times two. So you go to one side and then you go to the other side and that is an A drop rotation. And then you do both sides, another A drop rotation, both sides, another B drop rotation, and then both sides, a C drop rotation. So you need to farm it about 20 minutes or both sides each time. C drop rotation will get you a 6% drop chance of the systems or a 6% drop chance of the neuroptics, 9% drop chance of the main blueprint, and a 6% drop chance of the chassis blueprint. All of that takes place right here on Tyana Pass. I think technically it would require you to do eight mirror defense runs because each side's two and a half minutes, but that's fun. The thing is the drop rate is very low, right? It is very low, so it's kind of a pain in the butt. The nice thing about this is there is a secondary shop in order to buy citrine. You still need to farm the crystal materials in order to buy citrine from Tyana Pass. You need, I think technically, 1500 or so Belric and Rania crystals because that's the whole storyline of Tyana Pass. You get Belric and Rania crystals. You need to pick them up on the Necrolisk. I think you have to talk to Otak. We'll jump on down there, quickly talk to Otak, and I'll show you how big the shop is in order to buy Citrine. As you can see though, Citrine is a pretty simple and basic farm overall. You go to one map, you farm one map, and then you're good to go. Here's Otak, you do Unearth Citrine, okay? Unearth Citrine. From there, you can buy the Citrine Blueprint, Chassis Blueprint, Neuroptics Blueprint, and Citrine's Systems Blueprint. All in all for about 1500, 1550, 100 or so Citrine, Balearic, Rania Crystals. Nice. And the things you need to buy, I think, is the Stellated Necrothene, the gem material right here. You need to get rank 2 with the standing on Deimos in order to actually buy that, and then build it. And you also have to get some of the faceted time trites. I don't know if you have to build that as well in the foundry or not, but keep out for that. You can also buy Citrine's weapons, as well as some pretty decent arcanes through this shop, and other stuff like the Citrine's Last Wish factory scene. So if you need anything there, farm up Tyana Pass, and you should be good to go. By the way, everybody, hope this Warframe Hunter's Guide helped on how to farm Citrine. If it did, like, comment down below, subscribe, and check out and follow all the other social medias in the description. Pretty much Pupsker on most social medias, other than my second channel, which is Pupsker Gotcha on YouTube. And I also have an epic games creator code Pupsker, if you want to use that ever, and support the channel. Thank you, thank you. Cheers.